Hello guys, hello and welcome to a second episode of the Colonicraft. Yes, that's right. And uh, what we are going to do today? Well, uh, what about just chilling and doing something? No, no, I've got plans. I've got plans for today's episode and actually you can see I've been busy. Uh, I didn't get any fancy enchantments, but you know, well, uh, I need to work with what I've got. And I also have some gear, and I have a better, better gear in here. Yeah, some big and, you know, lots of stuff. And by the way, this, this is what I have, and... Lots of redstone, lots of coal, yeah. And what we are going to do in today's episode, well, I've been mining uh, in my mine, in my private mine, and uh, I found the skeleton spawner. Um, I know uh, that there are two spawners on the server, and uh, uh, one have, uh, well, I don't know who owns them, uh, but yeah, there are two, but you know, they are in bases and uh, the um, kind of uh, the access way to them is a little bit too complicated and I don't like complicated things. So what we are going to do is that we are going to build some like public skeleton farm and it's not going to be only the skeleton farm. I have a plans for that. I want to build their like automated wheat farm using villager and I want to build that a coal farm because you see you can see the connection right you can see it uh, like uh, you get tons of bone meal and then you get tons of wheat so you also want tons of cows yeah that's right that's right so this is what uh, we are going to do in today's episode and I've got a lot of wood right here and I want to build uh, with the quartz because I, I love I love that material and uh, yeah I want to build kind of fancy fancy stuff there so yeah uh, I will prepare myself and uh, next stop is our skeleton spawner Okay guys, so we are not at the skeleton spawner, but we are here at the guardian farm and I've been doing some AFK here because I need some sea lanterns and man, this storage system definitely need expanding because I've been here for maybe 4 hours and yeah, I've picked picked up some items and I checked something here and yeah this is this is just so small and I'm worried that uh, well you know this this won't be enough for the whole farm so yeah I will take some items from here and I will just put them here and uh, yeah so hopefully this will keep up in the future so let me just quickly put your dose but yeah definitely definitely good spawn rates and i'm super happy that we actually have one of these on a server and yeah maybe i've been thinking uh well this this should be better but yeah it's it's good work done and I won't be complaining about that, but I think the spawn rates would be actually better if uh, there will be there would be like uh, more spawning platforms, and they wouldn't be so big because you know you have a huge space in here and yeah a lot of lots of water and it's just taking so much time for the guardians to actually fall down so i've been watching this and when they spawn on the top of the water uh it's actually taking a lot of time to 
uh, for them to fall down to the lava. So yeah, maybe maybe it's it's worth it's maybe worth checking it out and yeah, I I definitely I don't want to complain about it. It's great great job done and yeah i've got what i came here for so now we can move on with our skeleton farm project and i have some amazing ideas uh, in my head right now so uh yeah uh by the way this farm was made by voodoo so thanks for that man and yeah the spawn rates are still pretty good you know with a little bit more afking and with a little bit bigger storage system this farm will be a super awesome so yeah i've i had a boat somewhere here uh yeah it's not here so uh, i will get back to our spawner spawner and i will start working on it okay guys so we are here at the spawner and as you can see i dug out the area that we are going to need and uh, what about this dirt uh this dirt actually disables the spawning of the skeletons no matter what light level is there so uh, as you can see it's only two uh two thick kind of wall around but yeah it completely disables the spawning and uh, you may be wondering why i have so big uh, hole uh well that's basically because uh if you want to kind of achieve the best spawn rates uh, you need to get those skeletons that are in area around it and the area is 9 by 9 by 9 so it means it goes two blo four blocks up uh, above the spawner four blocks down and four blocks to each side so as you can see i have this area around it and this is the area where if the skeleton will stay the mob cap of the spawner is six skeleton per one spawner so when the skeleton will actually be here on this level it means that more skeletons can actually spawn so basically how this gonna work is that a bunch of skeleton will actually spawn they will drop down here into some sort of water stream going somewhere i don't know yet where and uh, yeah much more skeletons can spawn again so that's the basic and let's talk about what i want to have uh, well i want to have a portal on one side and i think about this side and have like a staircase up to that point somewhere over there so you can actually uh, see the spawner uh, on your way there so yeah those walls will be probably glass and yeah somewhere i i'm not quite sure about that yet because well i need to think about it big uh well i figure out now that uh, i need to get those skeletons up somehow and yeah well if i have portal I'm not quite sure yet uh well maybe the portal will be actually above the spawner yeah that could work yeah above the spawner and i could have like a glass ceiling maybe well that would be a good idea to have kind of a glass ceiling over the spawner and uh, to to be able to see down here well, uh, I will just fill those walls in uh, somehow, and I need to be fancy because I I definitely want to uh, want you to be able to look into the spawner when you are asking here, and then I will come back. Okay, guys. So, what do you think? 
And what do you think? I think it's just cool. This looks amazing. Yeah, this looks amazing. Um, I well, um, when I was thinking about that, I wanted to use those quartz blocks, but I realized that this whole room will be most of the time turned off. So you are you are actually not going to be able to see what's inside so i am using those redstone lamps and yet the whole system actually needs to be hooked up but yeah uh that's not what i'm concerned about right now so if we take a look right here we can see that there is a glass ceiling over here over there and uh, yeah there's a kind of lookout and uh there's like one two three four five six seven seven block blocks uh that uh yeah that i want to oh that i want to actually keep like a space right here and uh on on the one side there will actually be the skeleton elevator that will take them up and on the other side uh, will be like a drop shaft down and uh, this farm will actually have like two modes one will be the killing mode or the afk mode and one will be like uh, xp mode so you are going to be able to choose from those two modes and uh, yeah when you will have this turn to an afk mode uh, it will uh, you will actually be able to see those skeletons dropping somewhere down yeah and uh, right there somewhere will be item elevator plus item elevator and uh, item elevator will be taking well maybe two um, maybe there there could be two one for the bones and the another for the arrows and yeah so definitely want that i want that and i want you to be able to see those items because i think it's pretty awesome and uh, yeah the portal will be over there I made my decision and uh, this will be like the end of this whole AFK room and uh, here will be like a crossroad between um, between the wheat farm and the cow farm and on this side like you know I want to have like four roads crossroad and on the uh, on the side that is actually not leading anywhere there will be there um, there are going to be two uh, brewing stations and one for the cows and the other one for the skeletons so when you are here uh, you are actually able to pick up some uh, some potions of healing and you will be able to kill instantly all those skeletons so yeah that's the plan and now i need to figure out the watering and actually i can do this right now um i've bring some ice so yeah let me just quickly put it right here and i will break one no i want one on this side just to see how far the water goes yeah well that's that's super awesome so the water will actually flow to this point and from this point i want to just test it it's like here good and from this this point or this uh, it will take like a curve and uh, yeah it will lead to that elevator so you 
you will be able to harvest all those skeletons. So, well, uh, I think this will make better sense when I will clear out this whole room and when I will kind of build the elevator. So, I will get to work and catch you when it's done. Okay, guys, so this is how I want to this room to look. And yeah now you get the same idea like i do so down there the skeletons will actually spawn and they will go all the way up to some point and they will drop down right here and i've got here a torch and i need to replace this block with a sea lantern so yeah and i need to cover this up because of the light level and I want this to be spawn proof, so uh, maybe I will cover this with the half slabs, uh, not sure yet, uh, let me just quickly check the light level, there, there's light level 7, and I'm not sure if mobs spawn on the light level 7, there's 6, well uh, definitely I need to work out something there's seven eight seven well i'm not sure yet but yeah uh this is the primary primary uh sorry for that uh this is how this room will actually look and yeah so this should be uh pretty functional right now and yeah uh here on the one side there will be like a lever for activating and deactivating the light and on the other side there will be a lever for uh, the afk mode or the X xp mode so yeah let's try to farm if it's actually working and i hope it's working that i built everything correctly so we can now knock out all this dirt right here and yeah you saw a skeleton right there so that's fine and hopefully we will get a lot more spawns and i don't want to fall down so carefully okay that side and yeah now we are safe so, yeah, uh, oh, look at them, I love that, I love that, so we need to just check if they're actually getting up or not. Well, I don't know what was that. Oh, well, that was... Oh my god, no. Why did he die? Did I miscalculate something? Uh, that, that's, that's not looking good. Let's wait for more of them. Oh my god. Yeah, I clearly miscalculate something. But the spawner is actually working working pretty good and yeah so i need to check this out and i will come back uh when i have uh the piston set up right here and the actual item sorters right there Okay guys, so we are right now at the portal to our skeleton farm. Yes, that's right. Look at that. And I forgot to turn on the lights. So let me just quickly go there and turn them on. So, yeah. Uh, so, this is how it's going to look when you actually come from the portal. So hopefully everyone will remember to turn the lights on and you will be able to see inside like that. So I love I love this because you know when you came from the portal you actually can look 
inside and you see the room behind that and this is CC for Colony Craft and right here they're actually going to be like instructions for how to use all those farms and what to do and I want to kind of uh, improve improve this look a little bit so I crafted some banners and let me just quickly pop some here and yeah this looks good and I want to go right here uh, careful not to step on the pressure plate because you can notice that there are all lights and uh, this is just for you can see what's inside the room and this is like automated lighting system so when you came right here over the push plates the lights actually turns off so yeah that's great and now let me just quickly show you what i did i add some armor stands and i really love that and i want to you know, put some banners right here i think this looks pretty awesome and uh of course I want oh I missed there one stone and I want to also add more of those banners so <clears throat> maybe here and here and yeah uh, you can see I wired everything up so this is the uh, XP mode and this is the AFK mode and I add some lava uh, down there because I want to make sure that every skeleton even with the mightiest armor uh, will actually die so let's turn those lights off and I love how they kind of turning off and on uh, one by one so let's quickly look at that that's awesome you see the rotation that's something that I love so yeah everything should be working uh, right now and uh, I am kind of uh, thinking about replacing those armor stands with the dogs actually because I think dogs would fit there perfectly but yeah uh, right now I'm satisfied with this and uh, yeah uh, I made the item elevators so they are functional right now I had some problems with uh, the bone one so hopefully yeah you can hear the skeleton dying and hopefully we will get some bones let's see are there any okay so we got some arrows but I'm not sure about bones oh, let me just quickly do there some oh well I burned them in lava yeah I forgot that my bad so let's quickly see if Actually, any bones can get up the, up here. Are there any? Well, this is kind of worrying. And uh, I actually need to check if there is no kind of spot somewhere because I have branch mines underneath. So, yeah, let me just quickly check this right now. Uh, well all those bones actually ending up right here and I don't know why really I, I don't know uh, well I think I will add a chest well maybe I forgot to put stone right here I, I'm not sure But this thing was working perfectly when I tried that. Um, let's just wait for more skeletons to come. And yeah, uh, so I will try to fix that. And basically, uh, I'm running out of time for this episode. And there's much more things need to be done. Uh, for example, the storage system. So the storage system will be actually right here and of course uh, the other farms but yeah this is basically it for today's episode so if you like the episode oh well i can actually go right here and light this up so yeah 
like that. Oh, this will be perfect. So, if you like the episode, please leave a like or a comment or consider subscribing me and thanks for watching guys and well, see you next time.